Uh, so it is Sunday today and uh, I'm actually heading to the Essence store because my boy is trying on a couple of pants. So I'm sending some um, to try on because I have two, three clients that are unsure about specific sizes from a new brand that we just got. So I'm gonna try them on for them um, just to kind of give them uh, an idea of what size they should go for. I'm heading to Paris next week uh, because we have an event with Y3, which is gonna be basically it's Adidas, Y3, and uh, Essence. We have an event during Fashion Week there, and I'm heading there with um, three other co-workers. We fly out on uh, Monday, and we're gonna be there uh, until Sunday. So it's gonna be a full week. Uh, it's really just for work. The last time I went, was uh, more of a vacation and slash work a little bit uh, for my own personal stuff that I do outside of my job. Uh, but this time around, it's gonna be strictly work. So I'm gonna be in and out. I uh, land on uh, Tuesday morning and then work starts Wednesday throughout Saturday and then I fly back out on Sunday. It's perfect too, because I can layer it like, yeah, super yeah. easily, you know? Yeah. Shit, how are you? I'm good, man. I'm good, man. Too much, bro. But it kind of looks sick, though, nah, still. Nah, like, I look so well, no, of course, yeah, it's going to be big on you, but... That's crazy. Wait. Boom. You're done, bro. You're done, bro. One time. You're done. He's a Even in the thigh. These. Yeah, so this is the Raph Simmons. As you can see, it's just... They're pretty high-waisted and they're long, so if you're tall and you're kind of always looking for something lengthwise that's pretty long, like these would be perfect. And then they have the little button details, but it's still like a settled pair of pants, you know, as you can see. what's going on guys all right so we just got to paris uh beautiful weather it's really nice out right now we've got these little beautiful uh balconies as always in paris uh today's tuesday we've got nothing planned uh just uh, uh just a normal casual work day I'm gonna go grab some coffee, uh, get a little bit of work done. Tomorrow we have the walkthrough and the training with Y3. And then Thursday and Friday is the sort of pop-up, Saturday the dinner, and then we fly back on Sunday. But yeah. I don't have my makeup on yet. Chill out. <laughs> Fun is bro, ready, bro. Cinematic. Fun is ready. Yo, you already know I got to... Cinematic, bro. That's crazy. Yeah, these buildings never get old. What's going on is we just got to Paris and it's really cold. That's what's going on. It's freezing. And but we're layered. We're layered. You oh, see shit. the jacket? Flex on. You see the jacket? We're layered. Really got a little color, you know? Yo, little... 
This camera is actually insane. It's, it's crazy. This cinematic is insane. Saying you don't need much to vlog, man. Just an iPhone Yo, anyone, that costs fifteen hundred dollars. Yeah. If anyone, Great. anyone wants to buy my, you know, Sony camera, that's it. <laughs> it's for sale. It's for sale. At a very good price. Hydrated puff sleeves is crazy. It's insane, bro. I feel like, yo, if I was eating and shit, I wouldn't be. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it looks really good, man. Yo, it's actually crazy. It's so crazy how small details can elevate a look. Yeah, the back like, with the pearl. Woo, don't sleep. Crazy. Do not sleep. Crazy. Let's see the. Okay, so this is the button. Single button. Single button. Yeah. Very nice. Easy pocket. And nice. you have the it's, details. Yeah, it's like the, puffer. It's like a puffer detail. Yeah. But it's also like it? a bomber it's material. Yeah, it's a bomber. Like feel it. It's literally a bomber. Oh, it actually is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shit. Yeah. Nah, this looks crazy, bro. What's going on? So I'm back in Montreal and the trip was amazing. It's about a week and a half later. I got sick when I got back. So it took a little bit of time uh, editing this video. But to be honest, I haven't really been as consistent on here because I don't know, man, I've just been in a weird space where, you know, with so many things going on in terms of social media, it's just hard to kind of decide on what I want to focus on, especially because I have a full time job. So sometimes it's a little bit difficult to be able to upload on all three platforms, but I'm not really trying to make excuses because I have done it in the past. I think with YouTube, it's just a little bit more hectic because it's my favorite platform. So I think anytime that I want to upload, I want to be transparent with you guys. I want to, I want to be honest. And on top of that, it takes a lot of time to edit these videos, but overall, um, I'm going to get back into it. I promise. I know some of you that have been subscribed, have kind of seen my journey and how I've always wanted this channel to be a lifestyle channel and more about everything that I get up to and some of the some of my passions that I want to share with you guys and not just fashion and I guess that's where I'm kind of struggling a little bit where maybe sometimes I want to upload certain things but I'm like is anybody even gonna watch it but it's just the stuff that happens a lot of the times when you are creating content where you doubt yourself but I think sometimes for me personally what I like doing is just taking a step back and thinking on how I want to approach, you know, uh, any platforms really, but more specifically YouTube, because YouTube for me is always going to be something that I use to kind of express all of my passions. You know, it doesn't just have to be fashion. And I think sometimes if, um, you feel like that doesn't connect with people or maybe no one is watching the videos it can kind of make you feel like, why should I upload or you kind of get demotivated, but it's not a good thing to do because ultimately, when I started my Instagram, I started at zero and I just posted things because I wanted to post them. And I think I should be doing the same thing with YouTube. If two people are watching it or 
10,000 people are watching it, it shouldn't really matter. I think my objective should be to express myself, right? So we'll see how that goes. Uh, but uh, the trip went well. Uh, I managed to pick up these. If you guys can see them, these are the Guidi's PL1s, which I picked up in this beautiful red. I mean, they're just amazing. And I went and got the Vibram sold done this week. So yeah, maybe I'll do, I'll do a, a styling video uh, for these whenever, um, whenever I can. But uh, I've already been wearing them quite a lot, which is nice. But yeah, um, that's pretty much it in terms of the, uh, the vlog. Thank you guys for those of you that uh, are still watching and still staying connected, whether it's on here, Instagram, TikTok, I appreciate it. And I'm gonna try to upload more on here for sure, especially this long format video. I'm actually doing, going into um, uh, a cut. As you guys know, I love my fitness and all that. I always try to implement it in these vlogs. So I'm doing, um, I think it's about, it's probably gonna be a 20 weeks um, dieting uh, from 209 pounds, which I am currently at, to about 185, which I did last year. So we'll see how this one goes, but I'm gonna try to document as much as possible. And if you guys enjoy it, definitely make sure to hit that thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. I'll check in with you guys later. Thank you as always. Peace.